biggest difference between uh, our product and uh, our competitors is that our blocks are eight feet long, uh, 18 inches wide, um, and they have a, a reversible interlock, so they work both ways. Um, a, another big thing with our product, they come uh, shipped folded, so we're not shipping air, uh, we're shipping all product, which uh, lowers your shipping costs. One of the biggest advantages to a builder is the eight foot block. Uh, like I said before, our competitors are four foot. We can lay 12 square feet at a time, uh, so you're adding speed. You don't have a uh, different interlock, so you can put it either way. You don't have to think about which way it goes on. You don't have any left or right corners. Um, you can use them any way you please. The benefits for the homeowner is that they are, uh, is the energy efficiency of the product. You're going to get R40 to R50 in the product, uh, which uh, lowers your, your costs uh, significantly. Other benefits to the homeowner would be it's very soundproof. Uh, for example, here in Las Vegas, we have an airport right beside us. Um, when this is all, house is all closed up, you're not even going to hear the airplanes going by. So it's very quiet, uh, it's strong, um, it's fast to build. ICF forms, is, it, it, all it is is a form. Um, the bonus is you keep the styrofoam on, it gives you your insulation. It's, it's, it's no different than using a plywood form, but we're leaving the forms on to create our insulation um, and a thermal barrier with the concrete. Um, the nice part about Nudura is all the webs here are from recycled material and it's about 70% of the weight of the product and any waste that comes off the job site is recyclable. So between being recycled materials we're using and the foam being recyclable, it's a very green product. We're not cutting trees down. Uh, we're using concrete and, and recycled materials. Well, first off, you, you stack your block, and as you hear, I've got a little demonstration piece here. Uh, these webs here are eight inches on center inside, encapsulated inside the foam, and you can see by these um, diamond patterns, this is where all these webs are. And these webs now become your stud, if you will. So what you can do on the inside, as this, this shows right here, you screw your drywall right to the block. There's no vapor barrier required. The foam is the vapor barrier and the concrete is the air barrier. Okay, so you put your, your drywall on, and if you're going to do electrical, as you can see here, you put a channel in the wall, um, embed your wire, and you can foam it back in, which goes right down to your receptacle. We have rebar reinforcement. Typically, uh, on most buildings, you're doing 16-inch number four bars uh, vertically and number four bars 18 inches horizontally unless otherwise required by a uh, designer or engineer or building uh, department. So it's completely reinforced which will reduce cracking and it becomes a very extremely strong wall. It's just not like a poured concrete wall, it is actually reinforced. Uh, Nudura has a, a technical department that deals with our, all our distributors if they have any questions regarding code issues or how to build the walls, what uh, rebar placements should be done. Um, we have a full department that will help them and in turn the distributors will help the contractors and that will help uh, the, the whole process go a lot smoother. We also offer training courses, there's a one day training course uh, to learn how to install Nudura. Uh, once you've taken that course um, typically a distributor will put you, uh, set you up with a, a contractor you can go work with for a couple jobs so you can really get the hang of it so you're ready to, to go ahead and do it on your own.